Good evening, everyone. Um, for those of you who may not know me, and thank you for the introduction, um, I'm Nicole, um, or Nix, as Abby will call me, and some of you might hear. Um, and I have the immense honor of being Abby's maid of honor, as well as I'd like to thank her best friend. Um, so we've been friends since our freshman year of college, and I stand before you today not just as a friend, but as someone who has witnessed the incredible journey that has brought us all together here today. Um, Abby has been a constant in my life, which is not just an understatement or not necessarily an easy feat. <laughs> um, as anyone can attest, she is one of the most compassionate, reliable, intelligent, and strong women you will ever know. Um, yeah. Um, our friendship has stayed um, strong despite any distance, and that has sometimes grown and shortened over the last 13 years. Um, and Abby never made this feel like an obstacle. I'm grateful for her like, passion for adventure and travel. Um, and so our adventures um, through all of this has allowed us to create some amazing memories that are as diverse as the places we've been. Because if you've all met Abby, she is will travel just about anywhere for anything. Um, so that's been wonderful. Okay, and I've talked about Abby. I could go on and about Abby for days. She's just an incredible person. Um, and I will literally tell people Abby is who I want to be when I grow up. But let's talk about the guy who's become an integral part of this journey as well, and that is Justin. I remember the first time I heard about Abby meeting Justin. Um, as you guys have all heard, I'll do a little brief synopsis, but it was a hinge date, and it was for breakfast. And Abby didn't, everybody who knows Abby, is she's not a morning person. And so the fact that this was a breakfast date was pretty impressive to start off with, regardless of if she was late or not. But she woke up eventually. Um, and so as time continued, you could tell there was something different about Justin. Um, unfortunately, I didn't get to meet him right away, um, but hearing over the phone with over 6,500 miles, I believe, between us, you could hear there was something different about this guy. The way she spoke about him, the way she talked about how he complimented her life and they made each other a better version of themselves was just something to really admire. Sorry. <laughs> um, and so, Eventually, I did travel, got to hang out with Abby for a little bit, and I do remember the first time I met Justin as well. Um, as people will know, Abby is a very organized human. Um, she already knew that we were going to meet, and of course, this was another breakfast day. And when she asked me if I wanted to meet Justin, I said, absolutely, if this is somebody who is important to you, they're important to me. And I didn't quite know what to expect. I know she liked him, so I could only figure that I would like him. Um, and then during that breakfast, met Justin, absolutely incredible, learned that he skydived as well, so some really interesting conversation, and then unfortunately I was like, I'll put together a collage, I have no pictures together, I have pictures of the food we ate together, as people who may know Justin, but I don't have pictures of us together. But, yeah, I looked, I'm sorry. <laughs> Um, but um, I quickly discovered that this was not just an interesting guy, but someone who shared the sense of adventure that truly complimented Abby, and that's all you can ask for for a best friend. Um, their relationship is a beautiful blend of kindness, strength, and unwavering support. And of course, it's filled with a kind of love that led to a globe-trotting proposal across Amsterdam and Germany, which, again, I feel like I get to be these very small slivers in their life, and I still remember the phone call. I think I pulled over my car because I was driving somewhere, and I was like, hold up, let me pull over, and hearing that was absolutely thrilled. And so it was a wonderful story and great to be a part of that. Um, um, so uh, today, as we celebrate the union of Abby and Justin, let us raise our glasses um, to a couple whose love knows no boundaries. May your journey continue to be filled with laughter, adventure, and the kind of love that transcends all adventures. Cheers to Abby and Justin. Cheers. May this be your greatest adventure of all.